the call from the drum Look at Africa, here we come Visiting the lands of Islam Scouts in Africa Through the jungle, down the mine Across the sea, beneath the vine Hurry now, cause we don't have time Scouts in Africa History in our footsteps We're belonging to see Many beautiful Muslims were one community Hear the call, bang the drum Look at Africa, here we come Visiting the lands of Islam Scouts in Kenya, scouts in troubles King Zambia, King the Rappos King Zimbabwe, on the double Scouts in Africa Alright guys, last joke before we land. Oh no! Just get it over with. Not again! Okay, did you hear the one about the poisonous snake who died while eating? No, what happened? <laughs> he bit his own lip. <laughs> <laughs> but seriously, they really protect wildlife in Kenya. Even snakes have nothing to fear. <laughs> okay, I've got one. Since we're gonna go on the safari, what's worse than a centipede with sore feet? We give up. A giraffe with a sore throat! <laughs> <laughs> what's worse than a giraffe with a sore throat? Don't know. A turtle with claustrophobia! <laughs> what's worse than a turtle with claustrophobia? No idea. An elephant with a runny nose! <laughs> <laughs> he only wants to pick up Mr. Husson? What about us? <laughs> Assalamu alaikum. Hassan Shabir, you must be Ahmed. Welcome, Assalamu alaikum, Hassan. It is my pleasure to welcome you all to Mombasa, Kenya. Scouts, this is Al Hafid Ahmed Mazrui. Assalamu alaikum, Ahmed. Welcome, Assalam. We better get to the hotel. We have a long day tomorrow and you must be tired. I have a question for you. What's the rest of the to be in with soft feet? Hey, على Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum assalam. Come in. Yeah, Thank come you, on. But I can't come in now. It's almost time to pray. Can't you hear the azan? There's a masjid across the street. After we pray, we have a lot to see. Hmm. Jamal, wake up. It's almost fudger time. Hmm. I'll stop you thieves. Never. I'll never give in. You'll never get the badge. <laughs> huh? Huh? Oh, I'm sorry guys. I must have been dreaming. After we pray, we'll get started on our trip. It's gonna take a little while. Jamal's busy dreaming about getting his Uma badge. We use this water for the generator electricity. But leave it beautiful and keep the water clean. That's how we respect nature. Even our markets are outside. That mustard is the Mombasa Jammy. This is the memorize the Quran and learn its meanings. That must be tough, dude. Sometimes, but Allah helps those who are patient and work hard. Mombasa was a big Muslim trading port. So Muslim sailors came here, right? Yes, that's how my ancestors discovered Islam. So what did the sailors tell them? They talked with their actions, not just words. That's how people learned. Really? The preserve we are entering is operated by AWA, the African Islamic Wildlife Association. This is the group that is sponsoring the Umabat work in Africa. I have a joke for you that we tell in AWA. Cool. Why do lions eat raw meat? I don't know. They can't cook. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, check it out! I just saw a huge leopard! Huh? Yeah. Oh! 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 Wow! Please go out! Oh! Huh? 
The most respectful thing, and the best way for us to learn about animals on the safari, is for Jamal to stop crushing our guide. <laughs> I'm sorry. I got excited. <laughs> I don't blame you. Leopards are becoming a rare sight. Even for Kenyans, hunters are almost making them extinct, even though they're an important friend for humans. It was my understanding that leopards present a serious danger to farmers and others who live near the jungle. I fail to see how they provide any benefit. By controlling our bigger problem, baboons. Zucky Faisal! Check out those elephants! Wow! Do you American brothers know the largest mammal in the world? It would appear to be the elephant. Is it the blue whale? Yes! It's taking a shower. From their smell, I'd say it was his first time. <laughs> <laughs> this safari has been more peaceful than I expected. Whoa! Look out! SubhanAllah! Huh? Was that a gorilla? I better check this out. This is strange behavior. She seems to be looking for something. Maybe she lost her baby. I don't know. Huh? Look, Brother Hassan, a truck. Hmm? A truck here? In the preserve? Hmm. Is there a problem here, gentlemen? Our car was just attacked by a huge angry gorilla. Did you say gorilla? Yes, it was a large female gorilla. She seemed very upset. It seemed as if she was looking around for something she'd lost. Uh, we can help you. We're gorilla experts, see? Like, uh, research. Yeah, research. That's it. I see. So don't worry about nothing. Yeah, nothing. <laughs> you scout boys run along. Huh? Hmm. What's that? Okay, thanks. Oh, they locked up this poor baby gorilla! These wise guys aren't researchers, they're poachers! So that's what the mama gorilla was looking for! I'd better go tell Brother Hassan. What are you doing? <sighs> Snooping around, kid? Don't know when to mind your own business, huh? So you what's in the back of the truck? So the gorilla was uh, hibernating and got uh, woken up. I see. Is that so? Yeah, so we're just gonna go find the gorilla and help her go get back to sleep. Yeah, that's it. Uh, we gotta go now. Huh? Yeah, so you scouts don't worry about nothing. We'll find her. Fine then. Get going. Those guys didn't seem like gorilla researchers. I wonder how they conduct their research. Alright guys, we should be on our way too. Where's Jamal? No good poachers, good for nothing. Jamal! 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 Jamal Come on, it's buddy. time to go! We're leaving, Jamal! Where are you? Come on! Jamal, we're leaving! Let's go! Huh? Let's move it! Brother Hassan! Zaki! Jamal's scarf is on the ground! It's the Ashbal distress signal! The Ashbal distress signal? When did you last see him? Next to the truck of those researchers! Ah, uh, just what I feared. Those two weren't doing any guerrilla research. They didn't even know anything about gorillas. Now they've got Jamal. We've got to get them. Brother Hassan, let me help. I have an idea. Go ahead, Ahmed. First of all, we should split up. You take the truck and see if you can cut off to them. I know a shortcut. The Ashbal and I will go together by foot. If we leave now, we can catch up to them. Inshallah, we can rescue Jamal there. Good work, Ahmed. Now trust in Allah and do your best. 